Hello everyone, welcome back to KOA Clips, where we bring you some mega castles from King of Avalon. On today's episode, we're going to be taking a look at the castle of Ravi from Kingdom 5012. Once again, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Ravi's castle is a 4.9 billion power castle. We've got a ton of troops great stats and uh, from the looks of it, it looks like she's uh, sporting a golden scepter on her account if i recall correctly i think Ravi had quit for a little while in the middle and has come back again and is playing again going on over into the skins looks like a ton of skins here i see a few eight stars a bunch of four stars uh, looks like there's a few two stars in there as well. Four eight star skins. Pretty impressive. Looking at the marches, we're looking at about five marches, a bunch of them not yet unlocked. Going into the accolades, there is a ton of accolades here. We've got the Nether Season accolades, some of the ones from the Zoot Gallery, as well as from the events, and of course the standard ones unlocked as well. Going over into the Dragon Spirit, of course, wouldn't expect anything but a Max Dragon Spirit there. Pretty upgraded equipment on them, looks like it's a Knight build. Pretty nice Dragon Spirit. Going over into the Dragon, 8 star, Max level Dragon, looks like pretty much all the skills are at 7 stars. Very impressive. Going over into the Emblems, uh, looks like we've got a bunch of legendaries, a few epics out there, uh, and some maps sitting out there for additional upgrades. Going into the Draconics, got one tier 3 gold, rest tier 3 red gems, very nice on there as well. Going on over into the statues, looks like a full legendary set of the Oracle statues sitting out there. For the heroes, pretty much a max heroes set over there. Does not look like the uh, latest ones worked on a lot, but works in progress. A lot of druidic epic weapons sitting out in there. Going over into the armor side, we've got plus four Holy Eagle set, a bunch of enchantments all around the block, and a lot of blood sitting out in the inventory as well. Looking at the gems, frost gems all the way down, a few epics some legendaries, some rares, and a full set of the knowledge gems as well. Looks like we've got the war gear and the abundance set. Wow, abundance set is at plus four, plus five. That is really impressive. That, that definitely uh, costs a pretty penny there. Looking at the inventory, again, a whole bunch of maps from the time long gone by. We've got a bunch of maps, some resources. We've got almost 5,000 royals sitting out in there as well. Unopened skins, some portrait shards, and of course, last but not least, some speed ups. Now looks like we're going to take a look at some of the uh, reports out here on right now. 
I see a lot of meadow alleys going up to the absolute no creeps on the hills. Some nice stuff out there. You know, I think we're going to get a little bit of a history lesson here. This is Adama. You know, back in the day when 10k stats were something to contend. That's what, almost a year ago? Taking on the monster here. We got Carmine. And there's a lot of history associated on this account. We're looking at some three mil rallies. And if you guys have noticed, you know, there, there's a constant stats progression, you know, kind of shows you how dedicated of a player this castle has been. Going from, you know, about 5k on the true stats, we're up to about 8k here. <coughs> Taking out Diesel. A bunch of fights versus Diesel here as well. Some mega rallies. There's uh, Gan also out here. You know, we were actually matched with Gan, but that the Gan castles are no joke at this point. I thought I had pretty good stats compared to those almost maxed out castles on the side. We're looking at some for Ollie here as well. It's almost like a trip down the memory lane at this point. Maybe here. Look at those mega rallies and the voice that this account's going for. Talk about a battle scarred castle. There's Panda. I'm just astonished and just, you know, staring at these battle reports. And over time, the amount of fights that an account goes through. You got a 5.6 million kill report right here. Another female kills. A bunch of reports against MK Bay. While you're enjoying some of these KOA reports history lessons, please don't forget to like and subscribe and show your support. Also, if you'd like your castle to be featured on KOA Crips, please don't hesitate to reach out to me or Pika or leave a comment on one of our videos and we'll get right back to you.
just to give me your loyalty Cause I'm taking the world you'll see They'll be calling me, calling me They'll be calling me royalty Falling in 